Happy Friday, Casey. Happy Friday, Jen. Thank you. Okay. This is Casey Sharp, and she is with Golden Gate Mortgage here in Columbia, and she's a wonderful, wonderful lender that has done a lot of great things for my people. We're going to do a little Fast Friday. How do you feel about that? I love it. Let's you ready? It. Okay, number one, what is a pre-approval and how long does it take? So it doesn't take very long at all, um, as long as you get me your uh, documents. So it will take a couple of different things to get you verified. We're going to verify some income with some uh, pay stubs and W-2s. Okay. We're going to verify who you are with your driver's license and social security card. Makes sense. We're going to verify assets for down payment okay. with your bank statements. So there's a couple of things that is quickly as you can get them to me, I yep. can get you that pre-approval very quickly. So the faster you respond to you, the faster I can take them shopping. That's right. Mm, we like shopping. Yes. Yes, we do. <laughs> Next, people will say to me, but I know I have a low credit score. What do I do? So we would like to see uh, a credit score of about 620. Okay. Uh, that's going to be definitely around a standard uh, for buying a home. Okay. Um, some, some programs you can go a little bit lower, uh, but a 620 is about a standard. Okay. Um, it's definitely important to talk with your lender about that and right. what your options are and how long it's going to take if you're below a 620 to get that score up to where you need it to be. Um, if you're about 620 to 640, you are good to go on buying a home um, with that credit score. Okay. Mm -hmm. And all of that plays into a part in the pie. So let them decide. I'll have people and they're like, I know I can't qualify. And Casey will call me and be like, they can qualify. Okay. So don't assume anything based upon what news program you're watching or social media post you might be seeing about the, the home market. Down payment, what is it? How much do I need? And do I have to have it? Are there programs that help me? I'm confused. Yes. So that's a great question. So down payment uh, generally is about three to 20%. Um, it's going to be based, it's a uh, lump sum that you put down that's based on the percentage of the purchase price. Okay. Uh, there are some programs that are 0%. Sometimes you'll qualify with a VA program for okay. a 0% down, uh, but typically you're looking around three to 20% down. Uh, it is best to uh, talk to a lender and okay. see what you're going to qualify for and what the best program for you is to determine what your down payment would be. And it's not always a bag of cash that you have in the bank it might come from other sources such as correct you could get a gift um, that could come from a family member or an employer oh. uh, that's definitely a great um, question yeah okay so it can be because people will hear I know I can't move money or receive money while I'm trying let them talk to you about that if that's not in her world to answer she's gonna point you in the right direction but right we, we did a closing today where I saw a line item for a gift and that was on there as their down payment. So don't think because you don't have this huge amount of money sitting around that you cannot buy a home. That's kind of a misnomer that we see all the time. The most important message is talk to a local lender. Local matters. We're going to talk about that next Fast Friday is why local matters. And we've all learned that lesson. And I'm Jen. I'm with Home Advantage Realty. We have multiple offices around the county. I would be happy to help you. This is Casey Sharp. And she's with Golden Gate Mortgage. And she does not disappoint, I promise. Because I know all the lenders. And she's really good. <laughs> so you. we enjoy doing this together. We hope you guys have a great Friday. And thanks for listening. Thanks, Jen. Thanks, Casey. Thanks for having me.